Rehim Khan bats for by Lawal, says Imran Khan promoting hate politics. Rehim Khan bats for by Lawal, says Imran Khan promoting hate politics Pakistan Tariqians chief Imran Khan's former wife Rehim Khan has once again hit out at the cricket turned politician, accusing him of promoting hate politics in the Pakistan general elections. Speaking to YN, Rehim Khan further said that marrying Imran Khan was the biggest mistake of her life. Pakistan Tariqians chief Imran Khan's former wife Rehim Khan has once again hit out at the cricket turned politician, accusing him of promoting hate politics in the Pakistan general elections. Speaking to YN, Rehim Khan further said that marrying Imran Khan was the biggest mistake of her life. When asked about Imran Khan being the frontrunner ahead of Pakistan general elections, scheduled for Wednesday, Rehim said that if the PTI chief becomes the prime minister, Pakistan will be driven to an extreme end. Referring to Imran Khan as an extremist, Rehim said that Pakistan will soon be labelled as an extremist nation if the PTI is voted to power. On allegations of the Pakistani army and eyes of backing the candidature of Imran Khan as the Prime Minister of Pakistan, the journalist pointed that the PTI chief had himself acknowledged that country's spy agency was interfering in the elections. She said, Imran Khan is acting like army's fangirl. She, however, added that no party or leader has ever came to power in Pakistan without the support of army or IZ. Nobody has came to power in Pakistan without the support of the establishment and if Imran comes to power he will come up that way too, said Reham. According to Reham, Pakistan People's Party, PPP, President Bilawal Bhutto Zardari has emerged as a breath of fresh air in the run-up to the Pakistan general elections. She said that while Bilawal had been making all the right moves and speaking against hate politics, Imran Khan was indulging in hate politics. Imran is not doing that, he is indulging in hate politics. His speeches are not decent enough to be printed in our textbooks, Reham told Wyan. She termed Pakistan general elections as a setup and added that no matter who is chosen to power, the country will have a compromised democracy.